Come here, Stance. Come say hi. Oh God, oh God, oh God, okay, okay. Look, look, say hi to everybody. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever the heck you are. Good whatever to all of you today. Hello, hi everybody, I see you guys, hi. So, here is what we are going to do today. I know, my uh, hat, it says Frankie, that's my boyfriend. I'm a goober, thanks. Anyway, so today we are gonna do like a Samba fusion, right? So, oh, Henny! Henny all the way from Norway, what up boo, love you. It's like, I don't know, midnight or something over there, whatever. Uh, so, again, we're doing Samba fusion. It's gonna be kind of mixture of, of basics in Samba with a little bit of hip hop influence, more groove than anything. I'm not gonna go as far as saying hip hop, but you know what I'm saying. So, first things first. I want to give a shout out to someone who sent me the coolest gift ever a couple days ago. She is a beautiful dancer and she makes awesome costumes and she decided that it would be an awesome idea to make face masks. Holy crap, y'all. Look at how fierce these are. What? What? Her name is Alexis Pollock. You can go to her Instagram. It is at Alexis, A-L-E-X-I-S, P-O-L-L-A-C-K. She has tons of different fabrics and all these really, really cool things. And she's also donating a bunch to the hospitals, which is obviously awesome to do that as well. So go check her out. Uh, the song today is called Nowhere to Go by Snow the Product. Uh, I'm sure you guys have heard it. I thought it'd be ironic and funny since we're all probably at that boiling point of losing our minds in quarantine. So, are we ready to rock? Are we ready to roll? I don't know what else to say, so let's just like do it. Here we go. Samba. If y'all have not taken my classes before, I usually go over like the basic elements and the technique before getting into them, especially if you're not a ballroom dancer. We're gonna fake it till we make it, kids. So, I apparently decided to put on the baggiest sweatpants I own today. What in the, okay, whatever, it's fine. So, you have two counts of eight in this intro. You can do whatever the heck you want. On the last eight, on five, six, seven, eight, there is four big impacts. You can do whatever you want with them. We're gonna pass through it. I'm sure you guys are all gonna be fine. So, the first, hi, Sons. The first count of eight, you need to back up because it will push you forward. Your right foot is going to start doing two samba walks or cruzado walks going forward. So remember, samba has that kind of bounce and that groove within the body. So keep that kind of flow in motion throughout the whole entire thing. So our right foot is going to step down one. My left hip pulls back. You can do ballroom arms. You can do whatever you want. You can groove. I don't care. You're going to go again on two. You're going to do a lock step. Three. Uh, four. That is a figure eight motion with your hips. Again, you don't have to do that. Try it. Figure it out. You can be like extra ballroomy, or you could be like more groove with it. Whatever feels good, you go with it. So your first count of eight is walking one, walking two, three, and four. So we're on our right foot. You guys are going to do a box step in samba. The left foot is going to crisscross in front. Five. You're gonna step side, tiny, uh, as I'm coming out of my frame, lovely. You're gonna do a back step on six. Let me uh, smush back. Five on six, so basically a grapevine. You're gonna do a little hiccup passe on the up count. You're gonna step back on your right foot, seven. Side, tiny step, uh, cross forward, eight. So basically all you're doing is a grapevine, pas de bourre. Should be super easy. So we have samba walks. Walk it one and a two, a three and a four. We go five, a six, a seven, a eight. One more time, here we go. We'll say the feet so that you guys understand. Again, I'm in mirror position so you can learn with me like you're looking in a mirror. Five, six, right foot goes. Walk right, left, right, left, right. Left, right, left, right, right, left, right. Well, that was confusing. I'm actually really proud of myself for doing that. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Got my left and rights. Feel good about it. So, let's walk it one more time. We're gonna go a little bit faster, and then we're gonna add the second count of eight, and then we're gonna like, do it to me a sec. Here we go. Stand backwards, you have two counts of eight, blah, 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 blah. Right foot, we go five, six, seven, here we go. Walk it one and a two, with a three and a four. We go five, a six, a seven, a eight. 
having a sword on. I hope you all are, are having an okay time with this. Our left foot is free. You guys are going to have like a moment, and by moment, I mean like literally two counts, so don't get all extra and into it. You guys are going to kind of grind all the way down to the left, so you're going to kind of work it. I know if you don't like doing hip circles to your left, you're going to freak out and probably fake and go to the right. I don't really care. So when you go down, you're going one, two. You're going to do a volta. Now, if you haven't taken my classes, a volta is a basic step. The fancy way of doing a ball change. So left foot is going to go a uh, three. You're just going to crisscross that right foot in front of the left in demi plie. Yeah. At the same time, your hips are going to go right circle. I know it's strange. You'll figure it out. So we grind left. One, two, a uh, three. You're going to go out, out with your feet on and four and four. At the same time, your arms are going to cross and open. So your hip weight will kind of be heavy and jolted. Go with it. That's the right idea. So from the top, we walk it right. Two, three, and a four. Box step, a five, a six, a seven, a eight. We grind one, two, volta, three, out, out. Kind of, sort of. One more time. Five, six, seven. We go a one and a two. And a three and a four. We go a five, a six, a seven, a eight. We grind one, two, volta, three, out, out. How are we feeling? Let me check these comments. Make sure I'm not missing a thing. Hello, everybody. Hi. Okay. So, yeah, obviously I'm going to save it. It'll be up for 24 hours. All the good things. Whatever. So, should we try this to music or should we try a little bit faster and maybe add the five, six, seven, eight? I think I want to do that instead. We're just going to do it from the top, add the five, six, seven, eight. Music. Here we go. Right foot. We go five, six, seven. Here we go. Walk it one and a two, three and a four. We box it five, a six, a seven, a eight. We go one, two, a three, a four, five, six, seven, eight. You guys are going to punch and hold your hips. I did that really hard. And I'm really sore. Oh my God. I just took, uh, I don't know if any of you are watching my stories, but Andrea Extend Bar, Andrea, the word, the name, with Extend Bar, like ballet, she has these crazy workouts for dancers, and I can't walk or breathe or think. So this is down. We're gonna go right hip, five. You're gonna go left hip, and a uh, six, a. Uh. So it's ba, 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 boom, boom. Five and a uh, six. Uh, the hips are going right, left, left. Huh, huh. And you guys are just keeping the hands on the hips like you're like controlling them. Like you're Pinocchio hipped. That was stupid. Here we go. You just did. And three and four. We go five and a uh, six. Uh. You are going to hold seven. You're going to go and back to the left. Hop together eight. Your hands are going to flick and swipe up. Uh. Sir, we have, from the grind, we go left, one, two, a uh, three, a uh, four. We go right and a uh, left, right, hold, left, hop, hop. Kinda. Should we walk it one time from the top and then try it with music? Oh, here we go. Stans. Uh, you're showing your butt to everyone. That's not ladylike. Here we go. Five. Six on the walk, here we go, with the right and the left. Lock step, here we go, box step, and here we go. Grind it, one, two, volta, three, out, out. Hip, 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 hold, hip, hop, hop. That last part is so unbearably fast. Whatever, you'll be fine. Here we go, y'all, two count of eight intro. y'all how we doing let's check in on hi autumn miller do hips start right or left on a samba walk your hips will be twisted and lifted towards the left with your left foot tendu back 
Yeah. So, so Nia, my best friend's on here. Oh my god. So, I'm gonna try to do it this way. When I'm starting the samba walk, my hips shouldn't be square. You want to lift and open and counter your rib cage and hip away from each other so that you have somewhere to push your hips. So they're gonna go forward, right and around, left and around, right, left, right. If that makes any karate weird <laughs> sense. Here we go, y'all. One more time from the top. Pumba, are you nuts? Oh, it's going down. Oh. <laughs> Basically, if you don't get that little last booty part, just go like this. And go, like, you're gonna be totally fine, I promise. Here we go. We are adding on because I say so. It's very easy. I think it's easy. It'll be easy. Listen, you just did like Egyptian realness. Right foot is going to start a normal Bodo Fogo. Now listen, <laughs> I have beef with the Bodo Fogo, okay? Bodo Fogos, normal Bodo Fogos, have a toe ball heel landing. I know that doesn't really make too much sense to most of you, but do not do this or that. That's actually called a syncopated botafogo, and it's very, very different technique-wise. So we're gonna do normal botafogos. Right foot is gonna crisscross applesauce down in plie. One. You're gonna take a tiny side step left. Up. Uh, replace your weight onto it. Toe ball heel on a bent foot. There should be no weight on this back foot whatsoever. So you're gonna do two of those, two normal ones. One, a, uh, two, cross left foot. Three, a, uh, four. Now notice, I'm not traveling too much because I want to keep it nice and under my body so I can step on my weight. So the hip action, if you're one of those, we're in our demi lunge to start. So this left hip is going to activate to push our body around to the side. We have to go. As I step forward on this right foot, my left hip is pulled back. Right hip is going to circle. As it pivots the back foot, I figure eight, figure eight down. Again, okay, this goes left, right, left. So you're doing two of these. The counts are one, a, uh, two, three, a, uh, four. You guys are going to do a syncopated Botafogo. Yeah. Five, a, uh, you guys are going to kick into posse. Now you guys can like hold your head. You can like scoop it up into your little tum tum a tum a row. You can do whatever you want with it. But this last one, ta, ta, ta. Almost like you're slapping yourself. You're like, I'm so good. Are you like applauding people? Yes. So three Botafogos, two normal, one syncopated. We have one. These are natural arms, by the way. Think of like a crocodile. You know what I'm saying? You can also open them. You can keep them on your body or keep them out. It's up to you. So Botafogos, we have one, a, uh, two, three, a, uh, four. Syncopated to your posse. Now, you guys are going to step down on that L count. Left foot is going to go forward, for diagonal. At the same time, you are taking those arms and you are swinging, swinging. It's like you're punching someone behind your booty. You're like, huh, boy, bye. Right? So we have Botafogo, one, a uh, two. This is so weird. Three, a uh, four. We passe, five, a uh, six, a uh, chug, chug. Let's try it from the top with counts. Let go. Five, right foot, six, seven, walk it out. We go cruzado, two, lock step here, box step there, here we grind. Go down, two, bolt to three, out, out, ba, 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 ba. Now, ba, 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 that's three accents, sorry. We have our Botafogo. We go one, a two, three, a four, five, a six, a seven, a eight. How we feeling, y'all? Should we go faster? You go a little, little faster so we can do it to music. Here we go, y'all. Samba. A five, six. Walk it one, walk it two, three and a four. Box step here. We grind. Here we go. Left grind. Two. Bolt to three. Out. Out. Booty. Da 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 da. Ha ha ha. One. A two. Three. A four. Five. Positive six and a punch and a punch. Cool. 
That's the timing of it. Let's try to get it with music. Let go. Stanzi is snoring so loud. I'm sorry. <laughs> are you nuts? Oh, it's All right, here we go. So, how are we feeling? Are we good? How's everybody doing? My head is sweating because I'm wearing a hat because there is a tragedy under this hat, y'all. Could you go over the first part's arms? All right, we'll do it. Here we go. So it's opposition always, never same arm, same leg, right? So when you're doing the cruise saddle walks or samba walks or whatever you want to call them, right arm is going to go out with the right foot because we are countering the left with the hip action, if that makes sense. So you're kind of like, huh, yeah. We go one, push it around, two, three. They can transfer and shift on that lock step or they can just stay out to the side. Both are fine to me. Honestly, I don't really care about the arms because it's kind of fusion. So like, just be cute with it. All you little cuties out there. Mm -hmm. And the box step. Yeah, let's go over that box step. So we did lock step. Left foot is going to circle around, crisscross in front. Five, a six, a seven is my right foot, a eight. Now, the more bounce, and I, I don't want to say the word bounce because that makes it sound like you're jumping around like a bunny, but the more flow you get with this, the more groove that's going to come out of it. So you guys obviously hear all the songs with Samba beat influence with music. That flow needs to happen throughout the steps. Cool? How we doing? Should we do it to music one more time? Here we go. Okay. Pumba, are you nuts? Always going down on Samba walk. Here we go. Samba walk. One, two, three, Tuesday, Wednesday, and four. Thursday, Friday, here. are probably doing fabulous that's what I think here we go we are gonna move on because we don't have that much more to do so we just did punch it swing at seven and eight I'm gonna be facing ish the back wall on this next count so our left foot just stepped eight you guys are gonna do a booty circle as you step to the left right tap now you can do whatever you want with your arms you can be like Mm, mm, or like, I don't care. Live your best day in quarantine life, you know what I'm saying? So, we just did seven, eight. You're gonna go circle right, left. So I'm tapping that little right foot as my left arm swings forward, or you just look over that shoulder. Either way is cool with me, that's one, two. Booty one, two. You're going to do a ball change flick. Don't put weight on it. It could be a kind of split weight. It's more just to stop your motion from going forward on this next count. So this is one, two, a uh, three. Now the beginning version or the easy version is just that. You're just gonna do the footwork. We go booty one, two, a uh, three. If you're gonna go for it, <laughs> we're going one, two, a uh, three. Now, if you want to drop it like it's hot, you just do you, boo. You know what I'm saying? Y'all can like flick it down, pick it. <clears throat> I don't care what you do. So, we did seven, eight. We go booty one, two, a, uh, three. You guys are going to snap your heads up on a. Uh, you're going to pick this right foot up, four. And you're just going to snap and look out. So, the right foot is just going to sneak back in on a, uh, four. Yeah? One more time, let's take from seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. We go seven, eight, we go booty one. Two, uh, three, uh, four. Now, again, it gets really fast. If you don't touch the floor, just slap your knee. Hold both knees. Or just boom, go, go. Like you can keep it very minimal if you want to. Cool? So let's take it from the butterfly goes. We have right foot. We go one, a two, a three, a four. Passe kick with a chug and a chug. We right. Ha, hoo, hoo, hoo. And three and four. 
Y'all, here's the good part. Hope y'all remember them because I don't really want to go over them again. Bachikatas, you're going to do three of them. Starting on your right foot. We just did four. Right foot should be pressed anyway. You're going to go ball, change. Now notice how much I'm crossing over so you can see that entire outside line of my giant sweatpants. <laughs> you go five, and you're going to transfer your weight forward, closing your knees. Step back. Rotate into a tiny ronde. That was too big. A tiny ronde. Six and a uh, seven and a. Uh, you're gonna ball change eight a. Uh. So all you're doing is three bach. That's three. <laughs> three bachicadas with one ball change. So we just did and four. We go five and a uh, six and a uh, seven and a uh, eight a. Uh. Seems easy, it's gonna get fast as you know what. Here we go. We do it from Botafogo's five, six, here we go. With a one, a two, three, a four, flat foot in the front. Hoo, hoo. We go one, two, a three, a four. Yep, da 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 So, how we doing, y'all? Do a house tour, that's weird. <laughs> Mm, nah. <laughs> Thank you, but uh, no. <laughs> so, from the top, we'll count it once, and then we'll do it to music, and then we'll move on, because you only have like a count of eight, really. Well, not even, it's like two, but it's so easy. Here we go, from the top, five, six, walk it up. We go a one and a two, a right, left, right, we go box step, box step, we grind. Bolt a three, out, out, we go boop, 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 boop. Do do hoo boto fogo pa 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 passe here with a hoo hoo circle tap hoo 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 ya da 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 hoo hoo oh here we go. Pumba, are you nuts? Oh, it's going down. Walk it out. Talk to me. How are we going? Do we have questions? Can I move on? Hair is on my lip. It's disgusting. My love. Oh, hi, Julia. Love you too, boo boo. Carter! My boy! What's up? I don't know why I'm yelling at you. I'm just really excited to kind of see you, I guess. <laughs> All right, y'all. Here we go. I said we move on. I think you guys will be fine. This next part's like so easy. You'll be fine. So we just did ball change, left, right, that's eight, and left foot is going to go tap and glide, right and glide. Now you can add some like ballroomness to this if you really want, if you're going to be like, yeah, yeah, ooh, you could totally go for it. I am not going to. So <laughs> the right hand is going to do a number one, can you see it? Okay, number one, it's going to go into your chest, in out. The next one's going to go in, tap the noggin out. I know it seems strange. You're going to go one and two, three and four, kind of, sort of, five, six, left foot. Here we go with a hoo, 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 yeah. I don't know what she says here. It's like, you know it, I know it. Okay, got it, nailed it. All right, moving on. <laughs> Bachicata, right, left, right, ball change. In, around, in to the head. Left foot should be free. You guys are gonna do swivels. Now, we've talked about them. If you haven't taken my classes, just pretend you know exactly what's going on. You're gonna go a left swivel, five. Right swivel, six. You're gonna do a swivel prep, seven. This hand is going to come across your head as you do a single or a double or whatever the heck you decide to pull a leg turn, autumn, whatever you want to do. So this is seven. You're going to go eight and kick that right foot into posse. So this right arm and foot kind of match momentum, right? 
So we have swivel, five, right, six, swivel, seven. This arm can kind of ballroom it out if you want. If not, just prep it. It's totally fine with me. Kicking hit, seven. You're gonna be turning eight, just trust me, okay? <laughs> you will land down on one. You can touch the floor, touch yourself, point to the floor, whatever feels good, that's what you do, cool? So, bachicadas, we have right foot five, six, seven, eight, and from here, the left foot taps outside. One, two, three, to the head, swivel five, six, seven, eight, whatever on one. Cool? How we vibing, y'alls? Could you go over the booty circle before the baka? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I know what you're saying. You good, you good, I got you. <laughs> All right, so we just did a uh, circle chug. Seven, eight. This right foot is going to booty. One, dab it, two. Right foot's touching on two. You're gonna go a three is down. Head goes on, uh, you snap and pull that right foot in, four. Bachicata, five, six, seven, eight, uh, in and around. In, tap the noggin, five, six, seven, eight, one. Kinda, 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 how do you spell bachicadas? <laughs> B-A-T-U-C-A-D-A, -A -A. bachicada. I don't spell it, don't get mad at me. It's stupid, I know. We're gonna go over from the top so you guys get the idea. I'm not gonna do it full out though. Here we go. Oh, are you nuts? Oh, it's going down. Oh. We're gonna walk it right foot start. I've been here since Monday, Tuesday, 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 Wednesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, 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 Saturday
four star to drag, eight and one. Yeah? Can you save this live stream? Obviously, got you. So, we're gonna count it. This is where you can screen record. From the top, with counts, if you do not have a screen recording device, have a very good memory. Here we go. You have two counts of eight at the intro to live your best life. The last five, six, seven, eight are giant accents. You can do whatever you want to them. We start with, saw, whoa, okay, that's a wall or a door. Here we go. You guys are gonna samba walk with the right foot going. One, two, three, a uh, four. We box step crossing in front, left and back, a uh, back and forward. We go grind to the left, volta out and out. Five and a uh, six, a uh, hold seven and together, a. Uh. Botafogos, right foot, we go one, a uh, two, three, a uh, four. I'm doing basic arms, you do not have to. Six, seven, eight. We grind right, look, ball change, head pull. Bachacada, bachaca, bachacada, ball change. In, groove out, in, tap out, swivel five, whatever. Seven, kick turn eight, hold one, two, up, three, four, figure eight, eight, a seven, a eight, and one. There it is. We're gonna do it half out to music one time, then we'll go full. Here we go. Puma, are you nuts? Oh, it's going down. Here we go. Stop it down. since Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, uh -huh. Thursday, Friday, Boston. Saturday, got nine right. minutes. doing is it good is it perfect all those good things so remember when you're watching this it is in mirrored position just mimic everything I'm doing it should work out just fine for you uh we are gonna go for it holy cow y'all let's like do this it's like let's like have our own little dance party uh, here we go <laughs> my uh, favorite partner from uh, Dancing with the Stars. Hi. Miss you, kid. FaceTime me later. All right. Here we go. That is it. That's all we're doing today. Um, I want to see these videos because it just makes me so freaking happy. Um, love it. Autumn, love you. Magda, love you. Oh, my God. All my friends. Y'all, be safe. Order these awesome masks from Alexis, y'all. Holy crap. I'll put all the info for her uh, in my story for you guys. I love you. 